guys, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited about the video that I am sharing with you today. I have been anxiously awaiting this video for a couple of months now. Today is my official Disney YouTuber 2019 Boo Ball upload. And if you're not familiar with the Boo Ball, my friend Beth over at the YouTube channel, The Collectioneers Club, has organized a month long Halloween swap, like Halloween party for Disney YouTubers. And every single day for the entire month of October, which is the best month, um, someone is uploading a scare package, an amazing package that came from someone else who is participating. And today's my day. Today is the 11th, October 11th, Lucky Friday, October 11th. And I have my scare package to unbox for you. And it's actually really big. And looking at the return ad dress was quite a lovely surprise. My secret swapper, my, my boo ball date is actually my friend Ryan from the YouTube channel Disney Pins Blog. And he is honestly one of my first YouTube friends and easily one of my closest and best YouTube friends. So I feel very lucky that he received my name and I'm so excited to get a box from Ryan. And Ryan never does like swaps and things. So I feel extra, extra fortunate. Like I got super, super lucky for, for the boo ball. So hi Ryan, if you're watching, thanks for being my my date to the boo ball. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and open this. I think there were some criteria for this swap. I think it was like a pin, a plush, maybe like a headwear thing and a treat, something like that. I don't totally remember, um, but I've really been enjoying watching these videos every single day so far this month. And I will link to Beth's channel and also the official boo ball Instagram update account in case you want to follow along for the rest of the month, which is totally what I am doing. But right now, I'm so excited to get into this. I can't wait any longer. It's time for my boo ball unboxing. That sounded kind of naughty, not blue ball, boo ball. <laughs> okay, so I already cut the tape open, but I haven't really looked inside yet. And I am seeing, ooh, I'm seeing some really nice um, fancy wrapping. It's candy corn wrapping, and I see on the very top, a card and I love that the card has all kinds of little um, Halloween kitties on it. It's like a little Disney Halloween kitty. I don't know if that was the intention, but good theming, Ryan, if you picked out the, uh, the kitty stickers. They're also actually kind of fuzzy, which makes it even better because like if you could touch it and pet it, then I'm into it. That sounded naughty, but sometimes I'm kind of naughty. Okay, here we go. Open up my card first. It also says Happy Halloween on this sticker. Oh, and it's a cute, um, it's a Disney card. It's like Fab Five style Disney card. Minus Donald, I guess. So you've got Goofy, Minnie, Mickey, and Pluto. And the card says, the whole gang's here with Mickey Mouse to search this spooky haunted house. It's very Haunted Mansion. But that's not all they're here to do. They're wishing lots of fun for you. Happy Halloween. And then Ryan wrote, Becca, can't wait for another Disney adventure, Ryan. And then there's Donald. So it is a true Fab Five card. Love the card. I'm gonna try to put this on my um, Halloween pin board. I gotta put this someplace where I don't forget about it. And now I'm gonna remove the cute um, candy corn tissue. I love this tissue paper. I like candy corn, by the way. I know not everybody likes it. Some people think it's gross. Uh, leave a comment down below if you're yay or nay on candy corn. I'm, I'm a fan, but I know some people just think it tastes like wax. <laughs> the texture I can see, I can kind of see where people are coming from. Okay, removing some uh, packing material and oh, everything is individually wrapped in here, which is exciting. I'm gonna start with the thing that's on the top. It's kind of wrapped up like a little, um, like a little candy, but it's a candy with even more kitties. I love these. I like want to peel the stickers off and just like keep them for forever. I'm going to put one right here because I'm a dork. Oh shoot, it got in my hair. Okay, never mind. That was a bad idea, but I do like the um, fuzzy stickers a lot. And I'm going to open this up. It feels really soft and squishy, so I'm thinking this is maybe a plush. Let's find out. Oh, it's wrapped up very well. I'm glad I didn't try to peek because there's no way I would have been able to figure out what the heck was even in here. It's wrapped very well. Definitely was not going to be any peeking or cheating. Oh my goodness! Okay, I'm so excited about this. Um, this is the plush. It's Minnie Mouse from this year's, I think it's from this year's 
uh, Disney store. I'm right because it's on her sneaker. I saw these at the Disney store. They're so, so cute. And Minnie Mouse, I believe, is dressed up as as a kitty, she is. She's like a Disney kitty. Ah, oh, I love it. Um, she's got a long black tail, and then she's got purple paws, and then can you see on her head, um, her little ears, her little Minnie Mouse ears, and she just looks so darling. She also got a little like dress on, little like tights and sneakers. This is totally like the type of Halloween costume that I would dream of having, like 80s black cat, Minnie Mouse. <laughs> it's brilliant. Um, and this is from the Disney store. I did see these and I like, I remember touching this and being like, oh, that's really soft. Maybe I should get that. And then I was like, no, Becca, you don't, like, you don't need to get that. But now I have it. So um, thank you, Ryan. I love her. I'm going to find a way to sneak her into my background, maybe next to Pluto, plush Pluto back there. So, oh, I love my plush. She is super cool. Okay, here comes another thing, also beautifully wrapped. Everyone's better at wrapping than I am. Like this one even has a bow. I'm the worst wrapper. Whenever you end up watching my person unbox their thing, you're gonna be like, oh, Disney Kitty sucks at wrapping. <laughs> it's true, I, I really do suck at wrapping. Ooh, what? Okay, so there's also a t-shirt and I, I think this matching the plush. I actually, I, I haven't seen this. I don't think I've seen this. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm so excited. Uh, Ryan, you're making me very excited. I want to put this on right now. It says happy, happy meow Halloween. And it's a t-shirt that has kitty Minnie Mouse. Can you see her? I'm tickled by this. Let me get close to my camera. Oh, it says it also glows in the dark. It glows in the dark. Okay. So happy Meowloween. And there she is, she's winking. And like, look at her skirt with the little kitties on it. And apparently it glows in the dark, which makes it extra awesome. I'm gonna have to try this on in the dark and run around like a, like a banshee and freak my husband out. I love this shirt, thank you. Okay, there's like still a bunch more stuff in here. I'm gonna go for this next. I'm just gonna shake it around. Um, I love the black, look at the pretty bow on this one too is so well packaged. One thing about Ryan, like Ryan is a store owner. Ryan owns a, a pin store called Disney, no, DPB store, DisneyPinsBlogStore.com. And he's like really good at packaging and shipping things. And then for me, like if I need to send something in the mail, it's like a disaster and it takes me like a month. <laughs> I am just not nearly as organized as Ryan. Oh my God, now look at this. This is some major chocolate. I do love chocolate. Chocolate's my favorite kind of treat. So we have, this says, this says on the back exactly what it is. Pumpkin plaque. It's a chocolate pumpkin plaque. That is no joke. This is some serious chocolate. Good thing I love chocolate, which I do. There he is, I'm a pumpkin plaque. This will probably take me like the entire month of October to get through, um, but I'm not mad about it. I will totally eat this right up. I'm also noticing that this is from a spot called Jean and Boots Candies, Jean and Boots, and that it's located in Pennsylvania, in Pittsburgh, which is where Ryan is from. So it's like a local, locally made, locally made pumpkin plaque. So I feel like I got a little taste of Pittsburgh for my Halloween. Okay, I think I still see three more things, which seems crazy because there's already been so much cool stuff. Look at this awesome packaging though. This is like a, it's a, it looks like a gift bag, but it's actually a box. And it says pumpkin patch, farm fresh, open daily. What is, oh my God. Uh, this is amazing. This is actually amazing. Um, this is not Disney themed, but it's well themed to something else that is a huge part of my life. It is a skeleton in a yoga pose. It's a skeleton sitting in lotus pose, meditating. It's a meditating skeleton. Um, I teach yoga for a living, that's my day job. And I also, I have a meditation practice. I'm a meditator. And um, here is a skeleton and he is meditating. This is very clever and very silly, and I'm totally gonna put this out in my in my space, probably downstairs, for part of our Halloween decorations. I love this, super hilarious, and it's very me, except for I, I don't look like this, but one day we're all gonna look like this. Just saying, not to be morbid or anything, but we're all headed here one one day or another. Okay, believe it or not, there are still two things left in this box. There's a little thing, 
and a big thing. A little thing and a big thing. Well, I believe that good things come in small packages, so this is the little thing. I'm gonna save this for last. And then there's like this big, this big package. So I'm gonna do this one next. And I'm squeezing it. I have no idea what's in here. But again, very well wrapped, very festive. There's just a variety of papers and boxes and bows. What? OMG. What? Are you kidding me? I gotta calm down. I'm just calming down right now. Uh, holy moly. Okay. So the theme of this is the boo ball, the boo ball, not the blue ball, okay? The boo ball, and it's named for the Haunted Mansion ballroom scene. You know, there's all like the ghosts like spinning around, which is, is like, I think the most classic scene from Haunted Mansion. And check this out, this is incredible. I didn't even think I knew that this existed. This is a Disney lounge fly backpack and it is the freaking boo ball on this backpack. What? You've like boggled my mind, Ryan. You have truly like boggled my little brain. Um, okay, I'm gonna try not to hyperventilate, but I'm gonna get close to my camera and show you this. So we have the famous Haunted Mansion wallpaper on the top, and then down here you've got the ballroom dancers. And I love the material, it's really unique. I haven't seen another lounge fly backpack that looks like this. There's a little pouch in the front. Ooh, it's even got the wallpaper background. There's a larger pouch up here, and it still has that cool, ah, the wallpaper on the inside. And then there's this clever little touch that I love. There is the floating candelabra from um, the hallway of the ha Haunted Mansion. So it's this very famous Haunted Mansion image as well. I'm. I'm like in love with this. I'm obsessed with this. I didn't even think that this was a thing. And it says it was from the Haunted Mansion 50th anniversary, which um, just passed. It was the Disneyland Haunted Mansion 50th anniversary. But happy anniversary, HM. We all love you, and this whole season is pretty much dedicated to you if you're a if you're a Disney YouTuber type. Uh, yeah, this is like above and beyond. This is like gonna make me pee my pants. So thank you. You're the best, and this is so cool, and I'm gonna wear this all around, and people are gonna be like, what is that? I'm gonna be like, wouldn't you like to know? Wouldn't you like to know? Okay, coming back down to earth here, I have one more package within my package, and it's also, like, it's a box, but it looks like a bag. It's very clever, I like this. Now look at this cool bow. Where does one find these types of bows? I'm asking you, sincerely, because that's pretty cool. It looks like a little, um, like a little sea anemone. I just make stuff up. It's just free association, basically, on my channel. Um, and this feels, okay, I think that a pin was like part of the guidelines of this swap. Not that you really have to, they're, they're all kind of like loose guidelines, you know? Um, but Ryan is like the godfather of pins. And this feels like a pin, but it feels like a really big, a really big pin. So I'm excited and also nervous to see, <gasps> what? Oh, I thought nothing could top the lounge fly bag, but this might actually be topping the lounge fly bag. Are you freaking kidding me? Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with this pin. When I saw this, I, I, sh I, I almost tried to get one for myself and then I like held off. And then I regretted it because it's just so cool and ah, I don't know what my problem was, but I'm so excited that you sent this to me, Ryan, because this is like the most flippin' amazing pin ever of life. I'm gonna stop talking now and show you the pin. Folks, it is the freaking Haunted Mansion clock. Everyone knows this clock, because the little things are like, woohoo, the little fingers are like, dee 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 when you go by it. And then the little pendulum is like, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Look at this clock, it's incredible. It's got a big monster face on it. Little claws for feet. This was also released as um, part of the Haunted Mansion 50th anniversary. I'm just gonna take it off of the card. It's really big. This is a hefty pin, it's, it's heavy. Like if I whipped this at your head, you would be severely injured. Not that I'm gonna do that. I don't even know what possessed me to say such a thing, but it's the boo ball, so you know, what do you want people? Look at the cool back. So there's a Haunted Mansion 50th anniversary logo, and I can see that it's limited edition of just 2000. Super amazing pin. Um, <laughs> this is definitely gonna go on my Halloween pin board, and I am so stoked to own this because um, I was kind of kicking myself for not getting it when it was released with all the other cool Haunted Mansion merch. Pretty, pretty awesome, if you ask me. Uh, I don't even know what to say. That was like such an amazing package, and I feel very loved, and I also feel very booed. 
with the boo ball. Everything was so cool um, and so thoughtful and I 100% love all of it. So thank you so much to my dear friend, Ryan, like truly like one of, one of my dearest friends. Um, I'm gonna leave a link to Ryan's YouTube channel, Disney Pins Blog, down below. If you like Disney Pins at all and you're not following Ryan's channel, you need to do that because he is, he's like the, the godfather of pins. He's the guy that you go to for pin information. He's got a wonderful channel. And it occurred to me while I was filming this that um, what I really wanna do is leave a link down below to every Boo Ball video that has been uploaded so far this month. So it started on October 1st and it goes all the way through the 31st. Um, but there's a lot of channels that maybe you're not following, so maybe you weren't aware that they uploaded, and I just want there to be like a, a collection of all the links for the whole month in the description box of this video. So I'm gonna list October 1st through yesterday, the 10th, down in my description box. And then as people upload, I'm gonna keep adding the video links because I want you all to be able to find these videos. So if you wanna binge some boo ball, <laughs> binge some boo ball, try saying that 10 times fast, go check out my description box. And I'm gonna try as the month progresses to continue adding the links of everyone that uploads. So eventually there'll be a comprehensive list down in the description box, um, mostly for me so I can have them all in one place, but also for you guys too. And um, finally, I wanna say a big thank you to my friend Beth from the Collection Years Club for organizing such an amazing um, event. It's been so much fun so far. And she is a wonderful lady and you should definitely go check out and subscribe to her channel. So I'll link to her channel down below as well. And I am just like, I'm not frightened. I'm not frightened. I, I actually feel very loved and inspired and grateful for this Disney community. And I'm excited for Halloween and I love October. And I'm feeling like the Halloween spooky, haunted, lovey vibes. I'm really feeling it. Um, yeah, I think that's all I need to say. I'm gonna go like play with my toys now. I feel so excited. I'm also gonna like start eating my pumpkin plaque. It's a plaque full of pumpkin. Um, so that's exciting too. Thank you so much for clicking this video. I really sincerely hope you will check out the rest of the Boo Ball celebration all month long because it's the best time of the entire year. I will be back very soon with more Disney related content, hopefully a little more fall and, and Halloween fun as well. Until then, have a magical day everyone and I will see you real soon. Bye guys. Mwah!